Hey guys, welcome back to another video of what a Minecraft Let's Play. And in today's episode, we're going to be continuing where we left off last episode. Making the compressed hammer, the auto hammer, and the auto compressor. I got those two mixed up for a second then. So, quickly and easily, I already know what we need off with we need wood and now I've got some just gotta find it plenty so we need four cropping tables and an iron block and four iron ingots in this exact shape. Now for the hammer, I'm just going to make a new one. The thing about that, uh, like this is when you make it, I could try to use the one I've already got, but I don't think that's going to work. If it does then I'll be surprised. I also have two heavy weighted pressure plates from when I was trying to make another barrel ended up not having enough iron so will it take that? no so we'll quickly make another one I'm going to be lazy. So, if I get this right, oh, that requires our and hammers, and that requires RF as well. I know both of these require power as well. Hmm. Maybe I'm jumping a bit ahead here with biting the bullet, but I don't use it that much. So I think I'll be able to get away with it. So I need a love drum. And if I can my conduit, that'd be a huge plus side as well. But just that, I think, I don't know, I think I had, a few other things that would actually be able to help me, such as a pulsating iron, found the pulsating iron. Now then. Where did I put my fluid conduit? Did I put it in my golden bag of holding? Okay. Be back in a second. And we're back. So. Apparently. Can you decide to crack them? Now. Just double check everything. Going around. Apparently, it's actually all up to date. Wicked. Even though it glitching is a bonus. In a sense, I see it as like an opportunity to progress a bit faster. And it also still is a bit cheaty. Right. But the main thing I want to put this out now is some sort of auto crafting stationary thing. So I need these things. 
which is pulsating iron and conduit binder to make item conduit I'm just going to create unit come down here and borrow a bank which will have a fraction still up there Like I said, it's going to have a fraction of the power in it. And that just means it's better. I've got to think about this a bit more to treat uh, strategically. I don't even know how you spell it. I don't even know how you say it, sorry. I do, but yeah. Nothing in that slot. Thank you. start going and I need the auto hammer I'm going to put that up the top I'm going to go like that that's got 32 that's got 0 and that's got 32 Nice charger, so it's one of these basic filter, advanced filter.
so it's going to go round. going I need to I hope I've got another skystone chest I thought I did apparently I don't doesn't bother me and I know I've just seen this little cane and now I'm gonna go all through my chest again try to find it there we go sorry for me going quiet there I was just making sure everything worked I zone out from time to time. People will know this if they've worked with me before. I zone out quite a bit while I'm working. So, want to make a hopper. I want to surround that in paper. We get ourselves a basic filter. This acts like a... Best way to describe it, sorting system. And you set what you need inputted and outputted, it does it automatically for you. So, another one. Think of it as an auto sorter. If you say it, so certain items go into that chest. Any of those items you specifically want to go in there, will go in there. What the? This is so much more efficient. I think I like this one better. So now any dust that this thing generates 
Oh, I already love that. I know I put a lot of resources in there, but already I'm getting a huge amount of bonus from it. And since lava is almost infinite. It's a case of who wouldn't want to use it. So I'm just going to go through every single chest at this point. If I have any ore, I could just do this. Aluminium. More crushed and this is not this. Ferris, more lead. So yeah, this is just quite easily nice easy auto sorter. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> we might have a slight problem. Apparently. to make my another filter and might need to also work on a few other things. Well I'm at it. Got it. Oh this is gonna be fun. Well, it's working. Though I might have to deactivate one of the generators and move the location of this setup. I'm just gonna stop doing it now. Because really, I don't want to have this deactivated for longer than I need to. So, since I've got another lava generator, no, I don't have mind. I am just a forgetful number. So, I'm down here. I need you. I'm getting set you to extract you to input. I bet you I could just run out for one generator, really. And all the dust is getting put into there. This is. It's not set up in the best way. And I know that. Let's begin off with another compressor. 
So I've got the iron. Just need four more crafting tables. Which I got all the resource from me. I'm a num nut, num nut again. I'm going to be doing that a lot in this episode. I can already tell. You're probably already saying you didn't need chests. I know. I messed up yet again. I'm having one of those days. I swear. Right. So we need four. Like that. And like that. To be on the safe side, let's make two. They definitely don't need that much. But I got plenty of iron to spare. How are you doing? And this is generating excess power. Wicked. I wonder though. Oh, I might be able to do it. Yeah, look at that. It means I can actually keep this set up a bit more. I don't have to keep moving it around. just have to see how it goes. So we want to set that to a priority of one and two. And so that. Would you look at that? I can get it. There we go. So, as you can see, the system is all running and it's quite nice and easily automated and I'm just keeping an eye on the power so it's got full power and that's got full power and is that generating extra? no it's keeping it the same that generator is empty and the bank is full Oh. Generators get a bit empty. Maybe I found its limit. Maybe I did. Or it could just be they're both empty. Not generating any power. I am a nut now. Hit it again. So any which cannot fit in here will then be put into here. Look at that already. Any minion dust. It's 
so I'm just gonna knit one of them break one. Break it. And there we go. Add silver dust to the pile. That's two ores. There we go. So we got aluminium, gold, copper, etc. in there. If I really wanted to, I could boost the power from downstairs up here. Apparently, so yeah, two generators is perfect. It's generating all right. So yeah, this is a bit more of a lengthy process, but at the end of the day, it's worth it. Just keep this going, it is worth it. There we go, tin added. straight down there now if I go in here and sort this it's nice and easy so eventually I'll have it more automated than it is now but hopefully that's going to help with getting a load of the resources I need so like the power station I want to have by episode 20 but I don't know if I will or not, but it's another case of wait and see. So, hope you have a good day, and have a good night, wherever you are. <laughs>